hello guys and welcome back so i have decided to first of all add the zombie damage what i mean by this is whenever we shoot this zombie then we want to apply damage to the zombie okay and then after this we will add all of the animations okay so for adding damage to the zombie right here let's create a public integer by the name of health and this will be by default equals to 100 okay then if we scroll down after this activate blood screen effect we will do the same thing as we did for the player okay when we apply damage to the player right here we will take this take damage and die functions or methods from the player movement and right here after this activate blood screen we will paste them okay and in here we will remove these things and at the top we will add a if condition so if the take damage method is called then first of all we will check if the current state of the zombie is equals to zombie state dot dead so if that is the state then we just want to simply return and don't want to ex execute the code down below okay so now right down below we will first of all if the zombie is taking damage then we will make the health minus equals to damage amount and this damage amount will be coming from the shooting controller okay don't worry we will add that in few seconds okay just as we did for the player okay so after this we will then check if the health is less than or equals to zero so if this is the case it means the zombie doesn't have any more health left so we will equal the health to zero then we will call the die method and now in the die method we will simply say current state equals to zombie state dot dead okay after this we will scroll back right here to the zombie state dot dead right here we need to add animations but that is in the next video as i said so after the animation what we want to do when the zombie die we want the nav mesh agent dot enable to be false okay we do want to disable the nav mesh agent so that the zombie don't move we will also disable the capsule collider of the zombie so we will say capsule collider dot enabled false then after this we will say enabled equals to false and right here when the zombie dies we will also increase the score okay but that is for the future videos but we will just leave the comment right here so that we know that we need to add the scoring system right here okay now we need to add value to this damage amount from our shooting controller so now if we right here on our shooting controller right here at the bottom we will create a public integer by the name of damage per shot and the damage per shot will be 10 okay this damage per shot will be changed at according to each of the rifle because some of the rifles will give more damage okay now if we scroll down right here we left a comment for ourselves to apply damage to the zombie so right here we will first of all create a zombie ai type variable by the name of zombie ai and this will be equals to hit dot collider dot get component we want to get the zombie ai script okay then we will check if the 
zombie AI is not equals to null then what we're gonna do we will simply apply damage to the zombie so we will say zombie AI dot take damage now this is this method take damage okay it needs a damage amount so for the damage amount we will pass damage per shot okay and then we want to play the blood effect particle system at the hit point but we will do that in our upcoming videos okay so now this will simply apply damage to the zombie okay the zombie health will decrease right here as you know the health is integer so remove the f from the end and also if we check our shooting controller if we scroll up right here we, where we create the damage per shot right here remove this f as well and then on the zombie ai right here make this c capital actually we need to create a reference to our capsule collider of the zombie ai so after this health what we're gonna do we will create a private capsule collider let's name this as capsule collider okay then in our start we will equals the capsule collider to the capsule collider component on the zombie okay make this in capital that is it now we will copy this capsule collider where the c is small and right here paste it that is it so those were the issues with it so now if we get back right here okay as you can see everything is set up keep clicking on the zombie so that when we damage the zombie you will notice this health decreasing okay so let's play the game try to damage the zombie actually we don't have a crosshair for now so that's why we can't aim at the zombie but if we shoot as you can see the zombie health is decreasing as you can see it is now 20 and now it is 0 okay and when it is 0 it shows dead okay if we check it out again As you can see whenever we shoot the zombie health decreases okay and when it is zero it shows dead that is it now in the next video what we will be doing is we will add the animations and also we will add crosshair as well and also the blood effect as well okay but that is in the next video